Akira. Down to 535 yen? Dang, Madam Ikkyo didn't even last us half the day. That's because you insisted we have the mango flan for dessert. Right! Let's pay our respects to the spirit of Wan Yu! Then get squeaky clean at the public bath! That afro is totally righteous! It's like the way biggest I've ever seen! Do you mind if I touch it? Oh my god, I already am touching it! It's the silence! Listen up, you two. There's no reason to try and spare your feelings on this. You've killed any chance of quality work from this fabric, ever. No need to cut us down right when we're beginning to get motivated. That's not cool. Well, let me see what I can do. She's still breaking the sound barrier. I'll put some elastic in. Yuck! How dare you give my haute couture skirt an elastic waistband? Hush now. Just try it on this way. Really? This spring, rock the poor papa look in a dorky skirt with an elastic waistband. No, no! It should be way flouncier. With the pattern you cut, there's no way it could be. Oh, man. It's wrong. That pathetic piece of cloth isn't even close to expressing an inch of the delicate beauty of the flower hot jelly. Not even a micrometer or nanometer of the awesomeness. My God, the Otaku Girl Ranch has been unleashed. It starts with the bells of all jellyfish. Not just the flower hat jelly contain a fluidity of motion requisite to their body structure. If that's what you want, I'll just disappear. I'm sorry. I can't come to the phone right now. Sukimi, let her please just stay still. <gasps> Jeez, at least stay sorry. Careful. Go slow. It's okay. Just let her be. There. It's finished. At least it looks a little bit more like a bell now. Hey, you're right. Not bad. Chico, could you sew it on the machine for me? No problem. But what do you want me to do with the edges? All your margins are on the outside. I really don't care. As long as it's shaped like a bell, that's good enough for me. It's a good start. But I don't think it'll get that shape unless I wear a pannier underneath. What? What? Pannier. That thing all the goth lolis wear under their skirts. You know, like a ballerina's tutu. Sure, I knew that. Oh, hey, let's go finish this at my place. I've got a bunch there. My bro's gone, and there's no one else to interrupt us. It's perfect. Chieko? Yes? You like all sorts of old stuff. How would you like to take a bunch of pictures of a cool old mansion? Actually, I love old houses. I recently went to a western-style house in Kamakura. Look. Wow. Can I ask you for one more favor? Perfect! Thanks! This is Chose going on my blog. Blog? Offers are just a scrunchie. Where did you get yours done? Aoyama? It was, huh? I was... I've always thought they were totally retro cool, but my agency won't let me get one. One more deal, please! Oh, it's so animal! So this is it. Not such a bad place, I guess. Excuse me, sir! Do you know where I can find this address? Uh, that place, huh? Dang. Why do those guys always make me drink so damn much? And who the hell wears John Perry on a rose day these days? Twelve messages. What the girl did you? Wow, the song is good. <sighs> it's raining again. I'm not here, but I'll answer. Speak. Hi, it's you, Koibuchi. I believe I said I wouldn't talk to you anymore, didn't I? Well, yeah, but I, I just thought. Oh, well, crap. I've had too much. My head's all fuzzy. It's getting dark. I'm over. Nice knowing you. What's that? Too much what? Talk to me. Hello? What have you... You didn't go and do anything stupid, did you? I'll be right there. What a dork. He's gotta be joking. I guess if I kill myself because I couldn't have Mr. Rama's keeper. 
Burdens are such a pain in the ass. I told you we had a crap ton of pictures of old dead dudes hanging everywhere. Now, are you ready to come out of your shell and help me with the dress? We can do this. Talk to me. Please let me go home. Why are you being so silly? My brother's not here. I told you. It's not him. It's... I don't like the way I feel. I get all heated up over stuff, and then I get cold all of a sudden. I'm sick of it. Too confusing. I want my life just to be lukewarm. Okay. Here it is. I want to take this jellyfish you drew and make it real. I want to see that. Got it? But why? It's beautiful. I am truly impressed! <laughs> and look! Another picture-perfect room! Be careful! I'm so sorry. I got overexcited. That's okay. It's totally cute, right? I love it. This room is divine. I wish I'd brought Midoriko and the others. I wonder if I could somehow give the feeling of that moment life. Not just in a drawing, but also in real life. A shape with my own two hands. Hey, Tsukiki. Gigi! Chieko! Huh? Lend me your aid! Psych! In your face! Were you scared? Because these are just my vitamins. <laughs> what? <laughs> Ow! Hey, stop it! Ow! Let out! Huh? <laughs> it was just a stupid joke. There's no reason to freak. Was dead. Your getaway car. Take me to the airport, please. Get them down entirely. Let's go now. Yes, sir. She wasn't dead, thank God. I'm finished over here. Okay. What about over on this side? Oh, oh boy. I fell asleep. These pearls are beautiful, though, aren't they? They're fakes, but they're high quality fakes. I think I want a little more down here. That's... Whoa. All done. <gasps> we finally finished! The day is saved thanks to the Sisterhood Human Wave Attack! Ugh. Fine detail work always gets to my shoulder. I could get the key to the Kunikata DVD box set as my reward. <laughs> Jelly's the pop idol of the jellyfish world. I think the tentacles came out really nicely, too. Hey, can I try it on? Oh, yeah. Tsukimi tore apart the necklace. But, uh, they are fakes, right? Yeah, no, they're real. Probably worth a few million. What? Did he pearls at least 10,000? I'm so sorry I broke your necklace. I just... I thought they looked perfect for the jellyfish's tentacles, especially the ones on the flower hat. I'm sorry. It's okay. Huh? I'm sure it would make my mom happy to see this. She always loved pretty dresses. Mama? What if... What if I were a girl? I'll give you these, too. I got them from your papa a long time ago. Yeah? 
wish you were a girl, then your papa would understand better. If only I'd been born as the perfect little princess. Maybe, maybe then I could have stayed with my mom forever. Never expected we'd stay out all night. Your fault again for not getting out of the electric bath in time for the last train. Sorry, I just kind of figured shock therapy would be the best way to zap away any stylish juice that got on us. Huh? What's going on? It's over. Spidey's been conquered. It can't be. なぜ気づかないのさ心をなくしたみたい